What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. This video uh, is about sharing in tires inventory between uh, multiple locations. Uh, if you're not there yet, hopefully in the future, you have multiple locations and uh, that's how you become rich and make more money. So I'm gonna show you how you can uh, share inventory and uh, create a purchase order. Man, it's like it's like AutoZone stuff, it's really cool. So let's check it out. Uh, so uh, first of all, I'm going to show you the multiple location view. So when you log in, you're going to see all your location right here. And we're going to we're going to order tires basically from Friends Auto. We're going to check if Friends Auto, if VIP has those tires and we're going to transfer them. Let's see how this works. So let's go to Friends Auto service. Let's say this is one location and we're going to sir create an estimate and let's look for some tires right here tires and let's say we're looking for 225 60 16. i know i have it so when you search it's going to search obviously your local inventory but there's a button right here assume that you don't have it right there's a button right there it's going to say search search all locations so if you have four locations it will search all locations so let's click let's click on that and we see that you know vip location has it so let's say I want um, those tires, I want four tires. So we click on four tires, click on add, and now we have all four tires. You can see the sign right there. It looks like inventory, but it's yellow. Usually the regular inventory is blue, but this one is yellow. What does that mean? That means you still have, just because you transferred it, that doesn't mean um, you took it from the, from the other location. You, you have to sell it first so how do you sell it just click on play let's say you sold this job we're going to authorize authorize now it's an invoice and we want to make sure that the other location don't sell these tires so what we do is click on place order and you're going to see right there request transfer click on request transfer and then it's going to bring you right here so you can send a message to the store let's say uh, I'll, I'll come get him right and then we're gonna click on request transfer and then it's gonna create a purchase order so you're gonna look see it's checked right there if we go to our purchase order right here we're gonna see that we place an order from VIP location that's just crazy that's just basically just like how AutoZone does it between uh, their shops so we, we're gonna click on that right there those are the tires that I need I can print the purchase order which is gonna look like that and and I can go get the tires from the other location which is cool so let's see what happened on the other side of this so we're gonna go we're gonna log out and we're gonna go to VIP so this is the location that we place order from first of all they are gonna get a, a notification so if we go to notification right here and we're gonna see right there friends auto placed an order and he said I'll come get them and so let's go check it out this is from before obviously let's go check because you can accept it and reject it so let's go to our under workflow right there you can see purchase orders remember these all options you're not gonna see them on, a, on if you don't have multi locations only for multi locations we are gonna click on purchase order right there and we're gonna see that friends auto placed this order and it's pending when I click on it, I have two options. I have, first of all, when when the, when uh, when via, when the friends auto placed the order, it did take those four tires from the inventory. If I accept him, that means I confirm that. If I reject him, the inventory will go back. So those four tires will go back to inventory. So let's assume we accept it. We're gonna click on accept, and now we can print the purchase order for friends auto so if you look at it it's gonna say vendor it's me right here and deliver to friends auto service with the address and the phone number and those are the four tires so the whole idea of it of this is the ability to share this thing is so close is the ability to basically um, uh, share inventory between other locations and keep track where those tires came from and where the and where those tires went. there's one more step what happens how do I track this when I need to just go to the reports go to purchase orders 
and you're gonna see store orders here again those all these features like I said are for multi location you click on store orders and submit and it's gonna show all the orders for each day so you can see where these tires went and accept it so let's go back to one more step sorry I know it's a little bit long but let's go back to um, friends auto service and see what happens so first thing friends auto service will receive um, a, a notification it's gonna say from VIP shop managing message accepted so this purchase order 128 has been accepted if we go back to that invoice and we click on view you're gonna see it was it says order before now it says accepted so you know you get the tires now it's your job to figure out if you want to go get those tires or they're gonna ship it and they're gonna bring the tires to you anyway I hope this helped I mean we do want to move uh, a little bit towards uh, supporting multi locations in an uh, in awesome way technology and all this and uh, um, but one step at a time so anyway appreciate you guys until next time thanks for watching